guys, I finally found the poppy. I noticed that I always present sometimes, well, most of the time, I always present y'all with a really big smile. I'm learning that like I speak so fast that sometimes I don't pronounce my words as much as I would like to. So this is my attempt at. Do y'all have somebody in y'all lives that when y'all hear, hear their names, y'all hearts drop? That's my only question. Today is Friday. Not really a vlog today, but this is the pre. Actually, my hair really. My mom rebraided my hair mostly in the. Who the fuck did hair. your hair? But I'm about to go shape myself up in the, in the front so I can look like something. Cause tomorrow, I'm going to Kira's house. We're going to New York City. Because Kira is Kira and Colleen, they have orientation. Well, Kira has orientation for her school, and Colleen is going to see if he wants to go to that same school. And then I have orientation at Parsons on the 14th. So, yeah, I'm excited. I'm so excited. I also just, yeah. I'm excited. I'm about to go shake myself up and wash my face and get ready for bed. Not really get ready for bed, but like rewash my face and moisturize. Shake myself up due to if I get water on the mousse, does that mess my hair up? I don't know. I'm gonna figure it out. I hope I don't mess my hair up. If I do, I just gotta let it grow back. That's the best thing about being black. My hair grows like crazy. Okay, so you're my bear from now. This is the first. So, I'm cutting my hair right now. As you can see, I'm pinned up. I'm about to get the chopping. It's actually coming along really well. So I'm confident. Let me, no, I'm not. Look at that. Perfect. Perfection. Look how that just laid. But that got to get trimmed, too, because that's a big block. That's a whole braid right there. You could grip that for a braid, but it's okay. Mimi did her thing with this hair. This is my first time having my hair braided since a young buck, like five, three years old. I think some around the age, but I ain't had my hair braided since then. I promise, like, I'm about to do a whole makeover. I'm about to exfoliate and everything tonight. You see all this hair right here? I don't know what to do with that. This is the wrong clip. That's more like it. But that's like really, really close. Like, I needed a little. What's the medium? What's the end? I think this is good. Let me see. This one is like, I feel like it's too low. I'm gonna have to like really get real close and personal with this one. All right, so it's time. It's the big reveal. Shout out to Miss Lauren. Miss Lauren gave me this clipper like a year ago and I still use it. So shout out to Kara's mom. Okay. I'm actually really good with this part. So I'm not even tripping. Maybe I should shape it down more. I'm gonna shape it down a little bit more just to be safe. I'm from Florida now. I'm a Florida boy. Hold up. Y'all. Y'all. Who the fuck did your hair? What? Nah, I'm on the phone. I'm on the phone. Oh my gosh. 
Oh. I look. Let me just do the last finish touches, cause. To all the men watching out there, even my ladies, the days, them is in betweens, you don't shave under the neck because that gives you a double chin. You shave just on the cusp, right above the Adam's apple. Maybe a little lower if you like it like that, but you shave just right there. You only shave all the way under here. No, no, that gives you a double chin. You keep the, you see how my hair, let me move into the light. You see how all of this gives me like uh, a more structure appearance? That's what you want. You don't want, you want roundness, but not too much. Look at how that came together. At first I was kind of tripping, but now it looks so much good, so much better. It ain't no damn hair to shape up. I'ma just make a triangle and go about my day. It ain't no hair back there to shape up now that I think about it. Damn, I look good. All right, so this is what my hair look like. I like it. I really like this. I look good and I like the way it framed my face. This is what I was envisioning in my dream. Oh my God, I look so beautiful. Like I look like something out of a, like my skin is so like, paint and polished and like really smooth you got them different highlights to the, the the ray of light shining off of it my white eyes my dark hair the way it shapes my brown face like <laughs> i mean like I, I love myself so much but i look good though oh i look good I never seen my hair like this. It's so kooky to me. All right, bye y'all. I need to go pick Zaira up from work. Let me show y'all the photos I just took. So this is zoomed in. You can clearly tell a difference from when I first took them. And this is when I first got them done. I didn't have no shape up, but. Ooh, it's giving BQ, it's giving Butch Queen. Yeah, I shaped myself up and I feel really good. I look good and I'm ready for tomorrow. <laughs> I got home a little bit, I got some homework to do. And I'm good. Look at, look at them teeth. Imagine if that's how I looked all the time. Teeth just showing all the time. Like, <sighs> that'd be kind of crazy. Now, I got to give it to them. My parents, they did a good job. God was on their side because look at his creation. Like, I'm so thankful that God found me worthy enough to be a representation of his beauty. You know what I'm saying? Like, like... I'd be amazed. Like, I'd be looking at myself and I'd really be like, oh my God, that's me. Like, almost if I'm in a third third person view. Like, it's giving like Rasta. Like, if I had dreads, you know when them dreads get they, they shape up. These are some, I look good.
All right, y'all. I'll see y'all tomorrow or when I get back. I'm going to show y'all my outfit. Oh, the light from this way is clutch. Y'all should see my little setup. Hey, y'all. So today is the next day. I look good, though. <laughs> so today is Saturday. I did not link up with Kira and Colleen. Um, but tomorrow is orientation day for Parsons new accepted students. I don't know if that's what they call it, but tomorrow I go to New York. And I'm excited because I'm excited because I'm going back to New York first. And then second, I'm, I want to see the rest of the, I've I've done the tour. But now we're going to like, they're going to teach us about our major, which I'm excited because I don't know what all in strategic design and management entails. I'm hoping maybe they teach us how to pattern cut and pleat and different like techniques. Like I know how to sew. I don't really want to be a fashion designer. It's like not something at the magnitude of a like Cavalli or like a Balmain. I'd much rather do like the logistics, the background of it. And then have like a brand. Nothing too like Artillier. But maybe I'm playing small. I don't know. But I'm excited. I'm really, really excited. I got my hair cut. So that's nice. Um, I got my outfit out already. So I showed her my outfit yesterday. This is what I was going to wear today. But I'm glad I didn't because it's cold out. Y'all hear all that wind in the day? But this is my outfit for tomorrow. I got my capris. These are a sample, actually. So that's really proud. And they holding up pretty well. Yeah, for the most part. And this shirt. I hate that there's that little stain at the bottom because you can only see it when you look in the mirror. Because when I look at it like here, I can't see it. And then I'm going to wear this over the shirt. And I'm going to wear my sambas to accommodate the black and white. Yeah. For tomorrow. And I'm going to pack some type of hoodie because you know it get cold out there. I think I'm going to pack my gray one, my gray thermal hoodie. Because it's big and I can like engulf myself in it and go to sleep. <laughs> but yeah, I'm excited. I'm really, really excited. I need to knock out some homework today. And I want to watch a new episode of American Horror Story. And I mean, that's pretty much it. Like, I really have nothing else to do. Like, my homework is fairly simple. I was just saying to my mom earlier, like, 12th grade is not as hard as I thought it would be. Like, this is light work. <laughs> I hate to say that because I would hate for it to, like, amp up, but it's not. It's not. We got, like, three months up to school, too. Like, girl, I'm out of here. Deuces. I really can't believe it. I'll be 19 in June. I turn 19 in two months. I'm excited, though. Oh, God, what you got planned for my birthday? Cause I'm ready to party. And this is the bag. I always wear this bag. This is my, this is like, this is like my, this is just one of my favorite bags. It's great quality. I found it at a thrift store somewhere and it's like in perfect condition. It don't got no stains or nothing on it. Almost like brand spanking new. Like I haven't even got no stains on it. I didn't even realize, I'm just you now realizing like how good I got like on this. Like I literally just snagged the deal. This is one of my favorite bags. It fits everything. I wouldn't want to make this a school bag. Only because this is really personal. This is like my very first. This is like to me, this is like a housewife's first Birkin. The Kelly in black with Espen Leather. Espen leather and polonium hardware, you know what I'm saying? Like it's just so special. It's something you cherish. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't wear this on a day-to-day, -day, like an everyday basis, like the school. And I feel like my school bag should be a little bit bigger, but it's just going to be my, my, um, I go to fashion school. Like I'm going to school for fashion. So like I just show up, put on an outfit and go back home. 
<laughs> that's what I'm thinking. But I don't really know if that's what they want us to do. I don't really know if that's what that entails. But I don't know. It's so crazy because I'll be thinking about like Ramir, Nashia, and Kai, and Daria, and everything like that. They went to college and stuff. And I'm like, they 23. Ramir got his BFA, BFA and stuff like that. And I'm just like, damn, like they went to school too. Like, it's so crazy. And I was just. I don't know. I'm excited. I'm really excited. Um, I know y'all see me in this jacket a lot, but it's such a nice color. I'm going to get to my assignment of the day and yeah. Bye y'all. Okay, so not much at all has happened today. Like, I haven't really done much at all today other than my homework. But I'm getting ready to go. Just one of my outfit that I had planned for today. Just because, why not? My belt. This is a new belt. Well, it's not new. But I'm using it. And got it a while ago. But my mom got it a while ago. But... It's new because I'm finally using it. This belt is like, I be needing longer belts because sometimes I don't be wanting to like, sometimes like, I be needing like the looseness of the garment to just be loose rather than always like scrunched up right in my waist. Like, let me see if I can show y'all what this looks like. So this is the outfit. khakis with the white shirt this is a unicorn shirt these are company 81 i think it's called yeah company 81 shirts khakis i thought these a while ago I don't know, it's kind of mew mew, like the khaki with the white. I don't know, I just don't want to be in the house all day and I just really don't want to just rot away today. I just feel like put on some clothes and do something. I don't know, I would like to go on a date, that'd be nice, but I think I'll save that for tomorrow, maybe. Who knows? <laughs> I'm so sorry about the background noise, but y'all probably hear me talk about this on my TikTok, but I have Apple Arcade and I've been really loving Cypher. It's like a 007 game. I, the more and more I play it, I realize that more and more like the age group is for because certain things that be happening, I'll just be like, this is too easy. It's not challenging enough. But then I realize these games are made for like nine, five plus year old children. So, but I like Cooking Mama, Cooking Mama. And I like Cypher, but I just recently started playing Game Room, which is chess. And I really, really like this one because I feel like it's exciting because I'm learning how to play it. But I don't really know how to play. I'm just watching my opponent and trying to like copy what they do. So in a way, I'm learning because I don't know how to play chess at all. But it's exciting. Bruh. How 
How did they get to do that? Get out of here. Maybe I shouldn't be like approaching them like that. So I did not win. Again, AI, bots. I don't know if y'all can tell, but we kind of like nipped the neck. They got if I do this, he ain't got nowhere to go because this can't move this. He just going to be stuck here. But what's my next move? Where else can I move? Mmm. No. Well, yes. Do this first. Then do this one. <laughs> Bye. Okay, so. AI wins. Like, I only because I forfeited. If I could show y'all, look, this is our very last, like, this is our very last position. I got so many of them. And, like, we were literally just, we was just skipping around the board with each other. This is cornball. Like, this is weird. I quit. I don't know what to do. I'm going to get ready for tomorrow. I think I might bring my iPad. I don't think I should. I don't know. Because I'm going to be like on that bus for like an hour. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm going to get myself ready for tomorrow. So I'm up and ready and on time and rested. Thank God I got my hair braided because now I got to worry about pooping my hair out. I just, put, I just go. You know how they be in church and they be catching the spirit? That's how I feel when I that's how I feel when I'm making my plans to go back to New York. I get so I get I get filled with so much like not anxiety, but I get filled with so much excitement that I almost can't contain it. Like it's been times where I've booked like tickets to New York and I got it wrong because I was so excited. So but this time I'm going because I'm going to college. So this is exciting. You know? I'm about to be a graduate, like I'm about to be an alumni, entrepreneur, and I have a degree. Oh, wow. Okay. So I'm here. Y'all know the drill, the and everything. We've done this about maybe four or five times before, but I gotta be there by ten o'clock. It's nine twenty-eight. It's like a forty-two, forty-three minute walk. Um, I'm not worried, but yeah, I got to check in with y'all because for the rest of this walk, I'm going to be listening to my music. So I just wanted to update y'all. This is, it feels like an SNL skit. smell of this place. Oh, it smells so good up here.
so regal and like cozy. Did I mess it up? <gasps> oh. Look at that. That's so cute. Okay, let me go with the rest of my class before I get lost. Nika Burger. Ah. For that. <laughs> you Thanks to me that. when I said I hope you go blind. Well done, you. Well done, you. <laughs> like, who's saying well done, you? Yeah. Me when I'm talking about my steak and you equal steak. <laughs> oh, Nika Burger. <laughs> well, uh -huh. equals oh, Nika and done, you equals burger. <laughs> it's not much to see down here, but. <laughs> Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Do you want to say anything else? No. Okay. Okay, y'all. So it's a little loud, but the tour is over. I'm currently in Whole Foods getting some things. I just came across tiramisu. I have not had tiramisu in so long. I'm getting one. You guys, I finally found the poppy. I don't know if I told y'all, but I've been trying to find these for a minute. I'm going to get a raspberry and a root beer. I feel like the raspberry... No, I'm going to get a watermelon and a raspberry. Or I'm going to get a watermelon and a root beer. Because I know I, I mess with root beer. And I feel like raspberry might not hit. So I'm going to just pick the two flavors I feel like I might like the most. I've been looking for these for a good minute. And I got some tiramisu. Look what I found, y'all. I think these are fresh baked pastries. Oh, I should Okay, so it's a little loud, but I'm on my way to Washington Square Park to meet up with Layla. They are grilling out here. I was wondering what that smell was. Are oh, they playing chess too? I don't know how to play chess, but I would love to learn. Maybe I should ask them if I can play with them. Oh, they not grilling. They also, I got tiramisu and I can't wait to tear it up. That tiramisu was nothing short of amazing, y'all. Nothing short of it. You know what's crazy? Every time I think about tiramisu, I think about my mom. Damn, I talk fast. I look good though. Um, every time I think about tiramisu or I crave it, I think about my mom because the first time I ever tried tiramisu was from Olive Garden and she had brought it home one day in her car and she let us try it and it was really good. I'm on my way to Washington Square Park now. Whew. It's been quite a day. I always get so tired when I'm out here. I really think it's that New York energy. It really drains you. I shouldn't say that. I'm about to be here for the next four years and then some, so. See, the outfit is actually really cute when you see the shirt, but right, you can kind of see the vision a little bit better. I'm opposite direction of the sun. I need to It was like a lot of the first week abroad. No. Yeah, I just got really to like. What is this yeah. so cute? I, I, it's like a bunch of chefs. So I am currently on my way back to the bus stop to go home. I got some poppy and some tiramisu. The tiramisu was really good. Um, I'm currently listening to Advil by SZA. And I had a really good day today. Today was, it was the perfect weather. Finally, because every time I've been here, it's been so cold. But uh, I'll chat with y'all once I get to the bus stop.
It's kind of giving like sugar free. You know how sugar free has a distinctive taste? It's bad. Period. Hold up. I was at 40, but somebody keeps subscribing and unsubscribing. But one of my videos did 3.2K. That's like kind of a first and my views went up to 3.5K. That is really good. Like that is a lot, a lot of views. And I've been posting on TikTok consistently too. So yeah, that's exciting. I got a cookie I want to try. I have ordered a cookie. I don't know what it is. Oh, they gave us tote bags. I don't even, I don't even really carry totes. I'm not a tote guy, but I mean, I bought two cookies. I bought a breakfast cookie thinking it was going to be good. It was not. I'm disappointed. But I also bought this brown butter chocolate. I ain't gonna finish that. Mm. That is the end of this vlog. I'm about to go eat and I'm going to sleep. I got school tomorrow. I'm gonna go watch a good YouTube video somewhere. I need to start editing this too. Thank y'all for tuning in. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Um, on a roll to 100, to 500, period. Wow.